right, so jumping on the highway and route to get some gas in my custom mode. I'm gonna try out this new gas station, and I think it is the next exit. So I don't think it's this exit, I think it's the exit right after this. But uh, just to talk about gas prices, uh, as everyone knows, the is this the exit? No, it was the next one. Good. As everyone knows, the Fed has dropped rates, so inflation should start to drop, and over time, gas prices should also drop. So that's what I'm hoping for. Let me get up here at this exit, and I think this is where the shell that I saw I wanted to check out. I haven't had a chance to do a dedicated street mode video, but it's coming, so don't worry. I want to wait until it cools down a little bit. Right now it's 94 degrees, still pretty warm out. Shell is my actual gas station, as you guys know. Let's see what the gas prices are looking like right now here in 2024. So my Shell V Power Nitro is three dollars and fifty-nine cents from what it looks like. You just make sure. Hold on. So three fifty-nine for V Power. Nitro. Let me just see if that's correct. All right, so regular is two seventy nine. Shell Plus is three nineteen. And what I put in my car, Shell V Power Nitro, is the three fifty nine. So it's pretty good. It's pretty damn good. Oh yeah, there's the sign up there. Two seventy nine. Okay. And diesel is three and change over here. Yeah, let me go ahead. Let me go ahead and shut her off. But. real great once these rates drop inflation drops and uh, this gas goes down even lower so i cannot complain about that 359 that's pretty it's pretty good if you remember the days in 2022 when gas prices were through the roof um, as most of you, you remember so you got to be blessed it's going down it's going to go down even further big things are coming I can't win making these videos sometimes. I try to come 
to a quiet spot. You got this guy unloading this trailer, making all this noise when I'm trying to film. I cannot stand when this shit happens. But I had an issue with the, uh, I guess the car reader was not working, so I had to go in and pay, so it kind of threw me off. But I put 40 in from where it was, I guess like a quarter, and it filled her up. So we're back to a full tank right now. So from a quarter, it took 40 to fill her up. It's not too bad. I remember those days where it would take, it would be like $80 just to just to fill up from the, from the quarter, you know? So I know we're doing pretty good. All right, here's the one that's right across the street. Just wanna check it out so I can know. If I wanted to come here, I think I like the uh, the first one that I was at. But there's one right across the street, and of course there's a Chevron right there. Just make a U-turn and get back on the highway. So, in a nutshell, gas prices are looking pretty good. Um, looks like, I don't even wanna to go to that Chevron because I don't shop there. I don't use Chevron gas, but. So this shell right here and then the one across the street. And yeah, definitely a decent spot. But of course, my Luxem guy, like I said, parks right next to me with a trailer with all this iron slamming slamming the trailer down and making all this noise it's like it's like i try to go to these spots to, to be to get away from stuff like this and it's like it just follows me it's incredible and along with other bs that follows me that i can't stand but back on the highway just in automatic mode but i'm curious to know what you guys are paying for gas in your states wherever you are i'm curious to know what the gas prices look like um, you know, here here in Texas, they're actually looking pretty good, so I can't complain. So just a quick vlog on, on gas, just to touch up on what everybody's paying and pretty much what the future looks like. You know, it's looking pretty good. So like I said, if rates keep dropping, inflation goes down, then we, uh, we all win. All right, so that is going to do it for this upload. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed, and I'll see you in the next one.